Today, on 10th of October, the European Parliament adopted unanimously an urgent resolution about violence going on in Iraq. What is especially important for me is that practically all political groups reach an agreement how to address the urgent question of Iranian opposition and especially seven hostages who have been kidnapped already for more than a month, whose fate is absolutely important, not only for their friends, but for the future of Iranian resistance and the credibility of Iraqi government. The parliament asked that Iraqi authorities would release them unconditionally and immediately. And the parliament also showed uh, and demonstrated that Iraqi government is responsible for this murderous attack on Ashraf and its residents. I think this is a very important message. We know that hundreds of people are on hunger strike around the world to support the idea to release these people and to get the question of uh, Camp Liberty uh, refugees settled as soon as possible, but uh, uh, this is an important signal to the Iraqi authorities that their behavior is not going to be unnoticed and that there will be consequences if anything would happen to the inhabitants of Camp Liberty or to the abducted people. The European Parliament, more than four years ago, adopted a special resolution about Ashraf and its inhabitants, where we defined that they are protected people under the UN and they should be guaranteed total freedom of decision and protection of their rights about their future, how they would decide by themselves. So it is today's resolution is a confirmation of this line and I think this should also be reminded to Iraqi authorities and other governments. European Parliament stand is clear. They, these people, almost 3,000 of them, should be protected, their rights guaranteed.